Open the hinge and there's a concealed screw. Screwdriver. By turning that screw, it affects the angle in which the arm opens to. These glasses are currently adjusted for my head. But what if your head is thin? Let's adjust this screw and make it fit. I tend to hold the glasses like this whilst I'm adjusting this screw. The mechanism's quite sensitive, so you don't need to turn the screw far for it to make a big difference. Adjusted the hinge now for someone with a thin head. Now let me demonstrate adjusting the hinge for someone with a huge fat head. Turn the screw and the parts slide against each other again. I've wound it all the way to its limit. Now the other side. That's as far as it'll go. Look at that. Nobody has a head that big. Let me put it back to how I like it. Wonderful. It's quite common for one of somebody's ears to be lower than the other one. I designed for that. Let me show you. Screwdriver again. Turn the screw and the mechanism rotates, adjusting the angle. This would be for somebody with quite an extreme variation in ear height and position. Of course, you don't have to go that far. But what you could do is you could adjust both of them that far, like this. By doing that, you've adjusted the tilt angle of the frame. I'm going to put it back. So I've adjusted one. You can see they're quite different at the moment. I'll adjust the other one now. Nearly there. There you go, and now they're level again. Let me show you the underneath of the hinge. Normally glasses have a screw connecting everything through the pivot axis. Instead of doing that, I've included this extra piece. Its fixing axis is offset from the pivot axis. That means when you open and close the hinge over and over again, it can't come loose like a normal hinge can. Wonderful. Now I'm going to show you a magic trick. 